We had an electrical fire and I think that's just a lot of smoke damage. Uh, something in the air conditioner. I think it's going to be a lot of smoke damage, but I can tell you really quick, I found out what is a value. And it isn't my stuff. I grabbed my kids and the things that were important to them, their blankets and their lovies. I grabbed my jewelry and our cash and my deceased daughter's ultrasound pictures that I can't replace and I just left. We're taking the pets to the vet right now and so day nine's video is none of it's important. Mommy, why are you crying? No, I'm okay, baby. I'm okay. It just scared me. I woke my kids up from the nap. My other kids are at school. I gotta pick them up and I don't know if we can go back tonight or if it's even been cleared by the fire department. Um, I am praising the Lord that it was not bad and that all it is is smoke damage and a nasty smell that we have to get out of there. So, day nine's video is not the decluttering video you were expecting, but it's a definite mindset shift for me because I was still viewing things as important. And they're just not. I didn't go in and when I had the opportunity to go back, when I ran back in the house to grab the what was, you know, a value, I didn't grab the family photos or I didn't I didn't I didn't grab what I thought I would. I'm not even really done processing at this point. It was incredibly scary. to see smoke billowing out of the wall and have to go wake up my children and go back in and grab all of our things and I'm incredibly grateful that that it was contained and that it was just a part that um, burned. I just, I mean, I realized that the only thing that's important is my four children and my husband and it's I'm incredibly grateful that we didn't lose everything and that it's just got to air out and that it's going to stink for a while. So I guess for day nine's video, I'm going to pose you a question that I really want you to think about. Um, I was in the apartment no more than 90 seconds from the time we figured out there was a fire in the air conditioner and woke up the kids and ran out the door. I went back in once for probably another 90 seconds what would you take with you that's the question that what would you take with you and maybe that's the question that we should all be asking ourselves as we're decluttering our homes Esther has given me a lot to think about I am incredibly grateful that my mom was had just stopped by for a minute. You know, God's blessings. You know, he just, he thinks of everything. She just needed to stop by for a second and drop off some paperwork. And she stayed to talk for a few minutes and be sweet and do my dishes for me because she knows I hate doing dishes. And he just, he does, he, he knows it all. She was there and she could she could stand with my kids on the sidewalk while I ran back in to grab their things. So I'm incredibly grateful that she was there. Thank you for watching and supporting our journey of doing life different. And so day 10's video is gonna be delayed because I'm we're gonna let the apartment air out for a little while before we go back in. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you in day 10's video.